Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel, Gypsy Wife Life. I am so excited to share today's video with you guys because it's going to be a little bit different than what I normally post. So in today's video, there's going to be a little bit of cleaning and a whole lot of decorating. We are adding some new things to our apartment today. So we decided to let our black mirror go and we got a new mirror for our bedroom so we went on down to the walmart this mirror is actually similar to the black one we have except it's white so it's the same size same style but it's white i've had the black mirror for quite a few years now and i wanted to switch it up to match my bedroom a little bit better so we got this white one and alan is just setting it up for me now And I'm absolutely loving it, as you can tell. I feel like it matches my room so perfect, and you will see why later in the video. So in my last video, I already showed you guys that we got rid of our black and white rug, and we got this new gray and white rug. So that's what I'm showing you now. So I already showed y'all that we put curtains up in our bedroom, but I did film this, so I figured I would throw this in here. So we got the curtain rods from Walmart, and then our curtains are just the older curtains that we had in our other apartments, which you might have seen previously. So I already had these, and we're just adding them to our room for now. In the future, we're gonna be adding the other set that I have in the living room, but in today's video, we're just putting them in our bedroom. So now I'm going to do a little bit of cleaning in my apartment because there's no way that I could decorate and put new things up without starting with a fresh palette. So I'm going to go ahead and do a super quick cleanup. This isn't going to be like a deep cleaning or a long cleaning routine video. I'm just doing some quick cleaning in the apartment before we put up the rest of the decorations. So I'm starting off with my couch. I'm just giving it a quick lint roll to get some of the cat hair off and then I'm just going to be piecing it back together and I'm going to do a quick cleanup in the rest of the apartment. So after fixing the couch a little bit, now I'm just straightening up the little roses that I have on my TV stand. Every time I straighten these up, I promise you, Cookie literally jumps up there, knocks it all down, and messes it up. So every day, I have to rearrange these flowers and put them back up. It drives me crazy, but it looks so pretty there in my opinion. So you gotta do what you gotta do sometimes.
So I'm actually not going to be doing anything in the kitchen as far as redecorating because we already did that earlier this year. Um, we're mainly going to be focusing on adding a few things to the living room, the bathroom, and the bedroom. But my kitchen is pretty much perfect because like I said, earlier this year we added some new things in there. So we're not going to be doing anything new in the kitchen. So I'm just giving y'all a quick little look of what my apartment is looking like now that it's fresh and clean and before we go adding some additional things in here. So the first thing I'm going to be decorating is my bathroom. I'm adding this little toilet bowl bleach tablet to my toilet. I'm going to be giving my toilet a good scrub down and also my bathtub and my shower before I start decorating. So I took out the laundry basket and the litter box so I could give the bathroom a really good sweep and a good mop in before I start decorating. And I'm also gonna be taking down one of my favorite things in my bathroom, which is my black and white shower curtain. But I have had the shower curtain for years, so I'm gonna be replacing it with a new one. Also, I am cleaning out my tub jets because they are disgusting. If you have jets in your tub, you know these things are pretty gross. So I filled up the tub with water and bleach and I'm letting them flush themselves out. So these are some of the things that we purchased recently that we are going to be redecorating with. So I got a shower curtain and some little curtain hooks. I got these new wax melts from Target which smell absolutely amazing. Got a new candle, we got a new bathroom rug, and I also got a new shower liner which is gray and it looks so gorgeous. We also picked up these white and silver sparkly bathroom rugs. So 
So we got the gray shower curtain from Home Goods if you were curious. And now I'm just gonna put the little hooks on the shower curtains and hang them up. I didn't record this entire thing because it took me a pretty good amount of time because those little shower hooks were hard to deal with. Um, they're just the little black plastic ones from Walmart. They're like a dollar. But yeah, they were a little bit frustrating so I didn't film all of that. So this is what my bathroom is looking like now. This is my shower curtain. It is white and then I have the gray um, other shower curtain behind it. So it's white and black. It says Tiffany & Co. And then I'm also going to be adding in a matching rug and one of the white sparkly rugs as well. And the white sparkly rug came with a, it was like a two pack of rugs. So I put one in the bathroom and then one by the back door. So now Alan is showing you some of the wall art that we got. A lot of you already know there is an inside joke when it comes to Angelina Jolie, so if you know, you know. But yeah, so he's going to be putting this picture up in the living room behind the couch. And then we're also going to be adding this Tiffany champagne bottle canvas on the other side of the couch. And now my husband is giving his Angelina Jolie picture a good wipe down to make sure that there's no smudges and no cat hairs or no lint, okay? I know you know what I'm talking about. But anyways, now that these are hung up, we are going to get started on the couch. Alan straightened it up for me a little bit. And we are going to be adding a new throw blanket and a new throw pillow. And both of the pieces that we're adding to our couch matches my bathroom perfectly. So remember when I told y'all in my last video that I was waiting on my new pillows to come in? Well, they finally came in and here they are and I cannot wait to tell you about these. 
These are the Pluto pillows. These pillows are 100% customizable and they are made just for us. So how this works is you sign up on the Pluto website and you fill out a custom questionnaire. They'll ask you simple questions about your height and weight and your sleeping position. And based on the information that you provide, they will create a custom pillow just for you. So that was my pillow and this is Alan's. And this is my cats now enjoying the box that the pillows came in. These are honestly the coolest pillows that I've ever owned and believe me when I tell you they are perfect for us. So Pluto is the first and only custom sleep pillow crafted to your body stats, how you sleep, and what you like. Each pillow is handcrafted to order with over 35 different variations. They also offer a 100 night risk-free trial, so if it's not a good fit for you, you can return it and get a full refund. And if you're not looking for a new pillow, these would actually make the most perfect gift. And how the gifting feature works is they can send your recipient a personalized email or a handwritten card with instructions on how to customize their very own pillow, which I think is great. So these pillows are cool to the touch and on the outside is a soft covering, which is machine washable by the way. And on the inside, there is a solid foam. Me and Alan both obviously like different things and sleep differently, so both of our pillows are a little bit different. They are firm but plush. They don't lose their shape. They're super soft to the touch but squishy at the same time. It's literally the best pillow I've ever owned and that's probably because it was made just for me. Yeah, so they have this squishy coating on the outside and then on the inside, there's a foam center. And like I said, they don't lose their shape. They're super bouncy and these are just so comfortable. It's definitely my favorite pillow by far. We've been sleeping with them for a few nights now and it's literally just like, it's heavenly. As soon as I lay down, it's like, oh my gosh, this pillow is exactly what I want and what I need. If you want to learn more about the Pluto pillow, I will have a link in the description. You can check them out as well as a coupon code to save you some money on your purchase. So another thing we're going to be adding to our apartment is a new decorative blanket. I put away the black and white one, which I have had for years, and now we are putting this one out. This is a super soft, comfortable, plush blanket, and I love that it has the little bows at the end of the bed. We're not going to be sleeping with this one, though. This is going to be our decorative blanket. We're just going to be sleeping with the white one that we already have on our bed. So this is going to be my new decorative blanket that you're going to be seeing in all of my videos from now on whenever I make my bed in my cleaning routines and such. And it came with two pillow shams, which I am going to be putting on the bed as well. And it also came with two decorative pillows. So this is what my bedroom's looking like right now. We have our new comforter, we have our curtains up with our new curtain rods, we've got our new mirror, our new rug, and I also put our new laundry basket in the corner of the room as well. And next we're going to be adding some wall art to our bedroom. So 
So these are the two pieces of wall art that we're adding to our bedroom. They are two canvas portraits of Bridget Bardo. So the bubble gum one is gonna go on my side of the bed and the other one is going to go on Alan's side of the bed. I literally love these pictures so much and I love the way they look in my bedroom and I feel like they make my bedroom look a little bit bigger but a little more interesting as well. So this is the end of the video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Like I said, it's a little different from what I usually post because we did a little bit of decorating or adding things in our apartment anyway. But yeah, I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, give this video a like. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you haven't subscribed already. And leave me some comments down below because I would love to hear from you. And I will see you guys next time.